myself dr sharan shetty uh, consultant in head and neck surgical oncology and reconstructive surgery i did my mch from amrita institute of medical science kochi where uh, it is a center or esteem center for head and neck oncology where we have been trained into looking into the oncological problems as well as the reconstruction i also been trained or has a fellowship from in surgical oncology from nizam's institute of medical science and further enhance my skills in laryngeal and pharyngeal surgeries from kidwa institute of kidwa memorial institute for oncology bangalore here we have formed an unit multidisciplinary unit known as care oncology unit comprising of medical oncologist radiation oncologist and allied specialties including nuclear medicine specialist radiologist and oncopathologist to give you a very comprehensive and an evidence based treatment to a particular problem i myself is very much specialized in reconstructive surgeries when you look into the tumors of head and neck especially tongue or the larynx when you remove the tumor you may end up with functional deformities like difficulty in swallowing or even with a speech with the help of reconstruction especially the microscopic free flaps we may end or reduce the functional morbidity and helps in early removal of the tube that is the nasal tube or sometimes you on the tracheostomy tube so the use of microvascular flaps either uh, helps in reconstruction when you when you when you take out the mandible we have the bones the bone that is a fibular flap which can be used for the reconstruction of the mandible so that the patient can easily achieve a near normal functional outcome in terms of swallowing as well as chewing also where with the help of with the help of dental implant the patient may also be able to chew again we have a very much higher uh, technologies and some of the instruments which are much better over here where we can give a, a very better outcomes especially when you take parotid surgeries we have the nerve monitors so that the facial nerve is injured to the minimal where the patient's outcome in terms of facial paralysis is very minimal thyroid surgeries we use a magnifying glass which is most commonly used but still it helps in the preservation of the recurrent laryngeal nerve thereby avoiding the voice related problems in thyroid surgeries and the multidisciplinary tumor board we have where each and individual case is looked into meticulously along with all the allied specialties and we come to a conclusion for the treatment and it is very important because as you all know the oncology is always a multidisciplinary approach is important so that the treatment is at at the best so that the patient is benefited at the most why do we need a regular checkup in in head and neck say for example if you have an ulcer in the oral cavity or a small white patch you may neglect it but sometimes this may be an early indication of onset of a tumor and as you all know if early diagnosed the treatment outcome is much better sometimes even with a single modality of treatment so i i i again emphasize on the point that even you come for a regular checkup so all these things should be looked into uh, like the ulcer in the oral cavity or sometimes patients may present with uh, voice changes where the patient needs a video laryngoscopy to look for any changes in the vocal cords sometimes the patient may have difficulty in swallowing where they need an endoscopic visualization which we have all which we have all the technologies all the instrumentations to look for and we have a better equipped lab the pathologist a very well experienced oncopathologist to look into all these matters to come to a conclusion so that any any early lesion can be diagnosed with perfection so that the patient doesn't miss it, miss up or end up into an late stage tumors even when the facial nerve is involved by the parotid tumors with facial paralysis we have the technologies and we have the expertise to improve on the facial nerve functions by facial reanimation surgeries like temporalis muscle transfer or even the gold weight implant so that the outcome for the facial nerve paralysis is improved i just meant to say that we have equipped very well with all the facilities uh, world class facilities we have and we are come we have come up with uh, very good uh, te uh, technologies in radiation and well expertise in medical oncology uh, regarding uh, follow up over here every patients which who have a, a white patch in the oral cavity a small bleeding ulcer in the oral cavity or a change in the voice or sometimes difficulty in the swallowing 
needs a regular checkup or needs a checkup with endoscopes and video laryngoscopy and thorough examination of the neck as well as the oral cavity using ultrasounds so that we can come at the early diagnosis and at if diagnosed in the early stage, the outcomes are very much better. Our team is uh, committed for uh, best treatment, that is evidence-based treatment as per the international standards, so that nothing is missed upon and a, a proper care is given to the issues related to the head and neck tumors. We here at Care Oncology Group aim at uh, evidence-based approach to all the tumors of the head and neck and committed for a better outcomes so that the patients are treated and assured the best treatment as possible in the world.